Hello, Greg. This is the digital video of your Duplo System 4000. That's the 1060 tower, the 400 stitch fold, and the 400T trimmer. And as you can see, we've already gone through the stitch fold and the trimmer. Uh, we're testing the tower, and that'll be the next item. Um, it's been gone through, but we still do a lot of testing on these. We run literally thousands and thousands of sets of these to make sure everything's okay. Uh, as you can see, I've got your one cover removed here. And uh, one of the reasons I did that was so I can look, show you inside of here. When you're going down to a booklet as small as the one you requested, which is the five and three quarters width and width, it's what's known as small processing or small paper. And you have to remove things. One of the items is there's another set of wheels like this one that goes right here. And then again on the inside, if you can see that green tab right there, which you can, you have to lift that set of wheels up. Then you come over here, and then uh, where that white tab is, and it's hard to see right now, let me take the cover back. Where that white tab is, there's another set of wheels uh, opposite of there that have to be removed as well. Then this guide you have right here has to be pushed all the way to the side. And then the folder, you get a small tab in there, and it's, it's very hard to see, unfortunately. Um, let me go ahead and turn the light on. You can see it now. You see that little white tab right there? When you're processing small booklets like this, you have to uh, put that on. That's an accessory. What it's going to do is, it, when it goes into the folder, it's going to keep it from turning. Normally, you would use this piece on the side here that you can see. But when you're processing small paper, you can't use that one. You have to use the one in the center. <clears throat> okay, we're going to begin our run now. I have, um, make sure your lids are all closed. We're set up with seven signatures. That's bin three, or bin four to bin ten. Seven signatures, 80 pound coated text. It's cut 12 inches in length, five and three quarters inch in width. And uh, what'll happen is when we fold it, stitch it, and then trim it, it'll come out with a final size of five and three quarters by five and three quarters. We're gonna go ahead and begin our run now. We're running at 2,250 an hour. Um, you're not going to be able to go much faster with this smaller paper. You see all the bins lift. Blow there into them and then it starts feeding them. Here they all coming out the bottom here. It's kind of hard to see, but I'll get in there for you. And then they enter into the bookmaker here. There's a jogger jogging them. See that side jog comes over and pushes it over. And the back jogger jogs it in. We got the other side jogger over there. It jumps over. A little hard to see, but it jumps over. Here's a set of beans stitch. And going on to the folder here, where they'll be folded. And here they are being trimmed. Exiting the trimmer, coming out onto the conveyor. I'm going to go ahead and clear these off right now. They build up pretty quick. You don't want to let them overbuild. We'll walk the system over again. Like I said, I've run a couple thousand through this already. Mainly this side here, but I have one some 11 by 17 and some 8.5 by 11. And I'll go ahead and show you the videos. I do videos on those in a little bit. As you can see, it's a nice, clean system. Everything is functioning perfectly. Power is, is really well. You see that big air blast there. When you're running coated stock like this, you're going to need to get a good air blast in there. You kind of see the paper flapping there. I'm going to have to walk back here and clear this off as you see it's building up. We're running to the end of our count here. 
Matter of fact, I think we're about to be out. Yeah, that's going to be it. A good way to check these is to, and it's hard to see, just look down the spine here. And you can see your stitches are all in the line. It's kind of hard for you to see, I know. And everything's coming out the right size. And it is uh, ready for you. Any questions? Feel free to call. Thank you.